Guys, so today I'm bringing guys a brand new sports cards video. In today's video, I will be showing you guys the top five sports cards I believe that you guys should be buying right now. Now, obviously, we just got word that the NBA could potentially be coming back on December 22nd. So obviously, you know, there's a big chance that the market as a whole in basketball will come alive in this next month or two. So if you guys, you know, obviously are looking to make some money, I would say right now is the best opportunity Every single season, every single year in the past in sports cards, we've seen this dip happen in the offseason where obviously prices sort of soften a little bit, obviously because players are not playing basketball now. Obviously, when it does come back, it usually comes back pretty strong, and especially this year with so, you know so much demand in the market, I, I can definitely see prices starting to bounce back very soon. Um, So yeah, with, before we get into that, I do want to say, as you guys know, I have my Sports Card Invest membership program. Most recently we were buying these Brandon Ingram Prism Silver second years for just four to five dollars um, last Sunday, and in a mat in a matter of five days, they have jumped to twenty five dollars, six times our money. So if you guys would like to go ahead and join in on the profit, um, go ahead, click the link down below to SportsCardsInvest.com and use code YouTube to get you ten percent off. Even though the market has not been as hot as it was in August, in these past two months, we have made more money than ever we've been doubling our money roughly every two to three weeks um which obviously and as a whole the market's been going down but we've been finding ways to make a lot of money um and a lot of picks like this some very underground picks that my team and I through our research have been able to find um so if you guys would like to join in on the profit click the link down below we have 3,000 members currently who are making a lot of money 92% of them are either renewing their monthly memberships or upgrading to the yearly memberships so if you guys would like to be one of those 3,000 people making some money with us click the link down below to sportscardsinvest.com and also we are giving away a Kyle Kuzma Prism PSA 10 on my TikTok at sports Sports Cards Invest. Um, sports Cards at the end of card is an S. So we are giving away this Kyle Kuzma Prism PSA 10. If you guys would like to do so, all you have to do is follow my TikTok. Um, but yeah, without further ado, we're going to hop right into this video. So the first big buy that I am really going hard on right now is Shy Gilgis Alexander. He is very, very cheap right now. Um, there was a point where his prisms were around 60 to 70 bucks um, raw, and obviously, you know, his optics are sitting at just 10 bucks. Um, I am going hard on his optics right now. I think I'm buying around 100 to 150 this week, um, and I really think these have a lot of potential to go up a lot. Um, there's a big chance that Chris Paul will be be leaving the Thunder, and if Chris Paul does leave the Thunder, the Thunder will literally be Shea's team, um, and Shea's team only. There's not really any other, you know, young stars on that team yet. Um, obviously, you know, the Thunder have had a history of, you know, drafting great, obviously. Um, back to back to back years, they got Russell Westbrook, James Harden, and Kevin Durant, um, and now they have all these draft picks that the they traded for Paul George. Um, the Clippers gave him a bunch of draft picks. So the Thunder future looks very bright. And obviously, Shea is going to be a big part of the future. I just believe his cards are very, very cheap right now. We saw his improvement from his first year to his second year. I can definitely see him continuing to improve with his work ethic. So I definitely think this is a very good buy. And probably the cheapest we will ever see Shea Gilgis Alexander if he continues to develop. So so I definitely believe he's a great buy. Um, in general, I definitely believe that you know both the Heat and Lakers players are going to get a big bump when the NBA prices start to bounce back. Um, hopefully by December, you know basketball cards are back in you know business right now. Obviously, right now a lot of money's been thrown away from basketball and into football cards. Um, a lot of money's been thrown into football quarterbacks, but obviously when the basketball season comes back, a lot of that money will be taken away from football and poured back into basketball, which will cause the basketball prices to increase. And when basketball prices do increase, I believe that the two teams that will get the biggest bump in prices will be the Miami Heat and the LA Lakers obviously because they played in the finals and their prices do not reflect that they won an NBA championship. LeBron's cards are still down quite a lot um, from August and you know he's won his four championships since then so it's only a matter of time you know when the market comes back I think these LeBron's 
you know, any LeBron cards, I believe, will skyrocket. Um, I believe they will go up a lot more than any normal card. Um, these are just very, very cheap right now. If you can pick these up, I can see these doubling, you know, when the market does come back. Because, you know, these are just due for a big increase in price. So I definitely think, you know, all Lakers players, all Miami Heat players, you know, obviously Anthony Davis, the Lakers are going to be favorites next year. Um, I think they are going to be, you know, definitely, probably, you know, they have a very good chance at winning the championship with Anthony Davis, LeBron, and the rest of those guys. And then I also think some very interesting picks are going for guys like Kawhi Leonard's 2019 20 Prism Chronicles. Um, the Clippers will be back. I definitely can believe that the Clippers will be a contender next year. Um, or at least people will think the Clippers will be a contender next year. And Kawhi's cards, this card was literally around 50 bucks in August. Um, and currently they're less than 10 bucks. I think this is a great buy right now. Um, this is still his first year Clippers card. If he ever, you know, makes the finals, does anything with the Clippers, these are really going to go up, you know, next playoffs. These could possibly be back up to 50 to 100 bucks um, if Kawhi is playing well. And then another kind of aspect I'm going at is the Nets and Warriors, um, especially Warriors because the Warriors have won three championships. Um, I'm going with a lot of Steph Curry 2012 Prism, I believe is a very good buy. Um, first year Prism for Stephen Curry um, because obviously he's a two-time MVP, best shooter of all time. Um, and his he will always be you know very iconic. What probably the best point guard in NBA history, if not Magic Johnson. Um, so I definitely think this is a very undervalued card right here. Um, a lot of Kevin or a lot of Kevin Durant. Kyrie Irving, Clay, and Steph I am picking up right now for next season just because they were injured. You know, their prices are still quite low compared to guys like, you know, obviously LeBron and other guys who have been playing in the NBA season restart. So I definitely think this is a very good buy. Going for a lot of Steph, KD, Clay. Um, I think these guys will get big bumps when the season does restart. I really hope that, you know, obviously Kevin Durant and Clay Thompson are back to normal. Um, I think Kevin Durant is definitely, you know, going to hopefully, you know, hopefully the Nets will be in title contention next year. And if they are, I can see Kevin Durant's prices and Kyrie Irving's prices really start to increase. Um, but I definitely think, you know, there there's a lot of money to be made, especially because the Nets have a huge fan base. You know, New York is a big city. Obviously, it's Brooklyn, but they attract a lot of New York fans, obviously, because the Knicks have not been too good. Um, so I definitely, you know, can see these really start to go up in price. Big market teams with big market players can cause huge price increases so I definitely think that's a very good buy right now um and then obviously just guys like Trey Young 30 point per game score um Trey Young's second year you know prisms are very very cheap compared to guys like Luka Doncic obviously rightfully so because Luka is a, on another level um but I still think Trey you know, it's a very good option right now, especially because they have Capella next season. Um, they'll have a sixth overall draft pick. And Clay and Trey Young, you know, he's a 30-point-per-game scorer. He's like 21 years old, super fun to watch. Um, he's definitely going to be a big part of the NBA's future. So I can definitely, you know, see these starting to get a big bump in price next season if Trey Young continues to play very well. Um, I definitely think that could be a very good buy. You know, there's just so much in the market right now that, you know, has the potential to to go up so much just because we've kind of been at a standstill for these last few months. Prices have been going down and down and down and finally, you know, they start to flatline which you see when, you know, obviously supply was outlasting demand for these last two months and right now supply is equaling demand. Prices are not really changing which is a very good sign because soon enough as people who want to sell continue to sell, supply will continue to go down and down and then demand will outlast supply and prices will start to go back up and especially with the season restarting and these rumors starting to occur prices are probably going to start to go up quite soon um so obviously you know these cards literally before they announced the nba restart were se selling for five bucks currently they're up to around 10 bucks um so you know we already start to see some price changes um since you know, the NBA has announced this restart plan. Um, so I, I can definitely see, you know, prices start to continue to gain some traction, which is definitely very relieving to see because we've been waiting for this for the last two months. Um, so, yeah, thank you guys.
guys so much for watching this video. Once again, if you guys would like to join the membership program and make some money with my team and I, click the link down below to sportscardsinvest.com. Use code YouTube to get you 10% off the yearly memberships. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys gained some value from this video. And other than that, I'm out. Peace.